In a world where the lives of royals are often as visible as the stars in the night sky, one prince's private life remains a guarded fort. Today, we delve into the intriguing secrecy surrounding one of the most eligible royal bachelors in the world, Prince Hamdan of Dubai. Known for his adventurous spirit and a massive following on social media, Prince Hamdan bin Mohammed Al Maktoum isn't just the crown prince of Dubai. He's a poet, an avid horse rider, and a skydiving enthusiast. His life seems like an open book with pages filled with thrilling adventures and public duties. Yet, there's one chapter that he keeps under tight wraps. His marriage. Imagine being married to a high-profile figure like Prince Hamdan but remaining almost invisible to the public eye. Not many can picture it, yet this is the reality for his wife, who remains shrouded in mystery. Today, we're peeling back the layers of tradition, personal preference, and strategic decision-making that might explain why Dubai's crown prince keeps his wife away from the public spotlight. Is it the intense media scrutiny, or the traditional values deeply rooted in UAE culture, or perhaps a personal request from his wife herself. Stay tuned as we explore the depths of this royal mystery, and don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe and ring the bell for notifications on our latest intriguing uploads. Prince Hamdan bin Mohammed Al Maktoum, the Crown Prince of Dubai, is not only a prominent figure in global royalty, but also an active social media user, often engaging with the public through platforms such as Instagram and Twitter. Known for his lavish lifestyle and public engagements, his visibility starkly contrasts with the almost non-existent public profile of his wife. Background on Prince Hamdan, Hamdan bin Mohammed, affectionately known as Faza, meaning the courageous, is the second son of Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum, ruler of Dubai, and Vice President of the UAE. His role involves significant administrative duties, overseeing Dubai's strategic growth initiatives and representing the Emirate on global platforms. Despite these responsibilities, he is widely recognized for his adventurous lifestyle, participating in activities like skydiving, horseback riding and cycling, which are frequently documented and shared with his millions of followers. Public persona and media engagement, Prince Hamdan's approachable and charismatic persona is crafted through his regular posts that showcase aspects of his personal life and hobbies. This transparency builds a connection with the public, presenting him as a modern, relatable figure. He actively uses his social media presence to promote Dubai's image as a vibrant, progressive city and to highlight cultural events and charitable initiatives contrasting privacy of his wife. In stark contrast to Prince Hamdan's public life, there is very little information available about his wife, Sheikha. Sheikha bint Saeed bin Thani Al Maktoum, whom he married in a grand yet private ceremony in 2019, has remained largely out of the public eye. This discretion is uncharacteristic when compared to the media coverage often afforded to spouses of other high-profile royals, such as the British royal family. The reasons for this privacy are not explicitly stated, but are likely influenced by cultural norms and personal preferences. Cultural norms and privacy. In Emirati culture, and particularly among the ruling families, personal life is often guarded with great care. The privacy afforded to royal spouses can be a reflection of cultural respect and the value placed on family sanctity. This discretion helps maintain a separation between public duties and private life, allowing family members, especially women, to live without the constant scrutiny and pressure that public figures often face. Speculation and public curiosity. The lack of information about Prince Hamdan's wife fuels public curiosity and speculation. However, this also emphasizes the cultural differences in how royal lives are portrayed and perceived globally. In the UAE, the privacy of royal family members can be seen as both a protective measure and a deep-seated respect for the boundaries between public interest and private life. Cultural values and privacy. Emirati culture places a high value on privacy, especially concerning women and family matters. This privacy is not only a personal preference, but also a cultural expectation that respects the sanctity and dignity of the family. 
within the context of the UAE's tribal and traditional societal structure, revealing too much about one's private life can be seen as intrusive. For Emirati royals, this means that even in an age of global connectivity and social media, traditional norms about privacy continue to hold significant sway. Role of women in Emirati society. Traditionally, Emirati women have had a more reserved role in public life, although modernization and reforms have gradually increased women's presence in public and professional domains, personal aspects remain quite private. For royal women, this is even more pronounced. Their participation in public events is often curated and closely aligned with specific cultural or charitable functions that reflect their roles within the community respectfully and conservatively. Comparison with other royal families. Unlike Western royal families, where public engagements and media coverage of royal spouses are common, Middle Eastern royal families often keep a strict boundary between public duties and private lives. This can be contrasted with the British royal family, where the spouses of royals are frequently in the media spotlight, engaging in public duties and being actively involved in various social causes. The difference highlights a cultural divergence where Middle Eastern norms prioritize privacy over public visibility. Impact of religion on privacy norms. Islam, the predominant religion in the UAE, also plays a role in these cultural practices. Islamic teachings often emphasize modesty and privacy, particularly concerning women. These religious values reinforce cultural norms and influence the public behavior of royal family members guiding how they present themselves and their families in the public eye. Privacy as a form of respect. In Emirati culture, maintaining a private life is also seen as a form of respect towards one's family and their dignity. By keeping his wife away from the public eye, Prince Hamdan may be adhering to a cultural imperative that values the protection of family privacy as a way to preserve their honor and respect within the community. Prince Hamdan's public image. Known for his charismatic and approachable persona, Prince Hamdan actively engages with both the local community and the international public through social media. He shares aspects of his adventurous lifestyle, which includes skydiving, horse riding and traveling. This openness, however, predominantly revolves around his personal achievements and public responsibilities rather than his private life. His decision to withhold details about his wife can be seen as a deliberate choice to separate his public persona from his private life. Personal preferences for privacy. Despite his public visibility, Prince Hamdan has consistently maintained a private boundary around his immediate family, particularly his wife. This preference for privacy can be rooted in a desire to protect his loved ones from the invasive nature of media scrutiny, which can often lead to undue pressure and unwanted public attention this is a common practice among high-profile individuals who wish to shield their personal relationships from the public eye, thereby preserving the sanctity and normalcy of their private lives. Speculations and Assumptions In the absence of official statements, the public and media often speculate about the reasons behind such privacy. It is suggested that his wife, sharing similar cultural backgrounds, might also prefer staying out of the public spotlight. This mutual preference for privacy helps maintain a stable personal environment, free from the distortions of media interpretation and the potential criticisms that public figures often face. Respect for family wishes. It is possible that the decision to keep his wife out of the public eye is also in alignment with her wishes or the wishes of both families involved. Respecting these personal desires is crucial in high-profile marriages where the pressures of public life can strain personal relationships. By keeping their marriage private, Prince Hamdan is likely respecting a shared desire for normalcy and privacy. Cultural influence on personal decisions. While personal choice plays a significant role, it is also influenced by the cultural context of Emirati society, where privacy is highly valued. The culture emphasizes the importance of protecting family privacy as a way of maintaining dignity and respect. This cultural ethos likely reinforces Prince Hamdan's personal inclination to keep his marital life private. In the heart of Dubai, amidst the gleaming towers and bustling streets, 
lies a story of love and royalty that has captured the imagination of many. It is the tale of Sheikh Hamdan bin Muhammad bin Rashid al Maktoum, affectionately known as Faza, the Crown Prince of Dubai, and his beloved wife, Sheikha Sheikha bin Said bin Thani al Maktoum. Their journey together is not just one of regal splendor, but also of deep personal connection and commitment. Sheikh Hamdan, the charismatic Crown Prince of Dubai, has long been a figure of intrigue and admiration. His passion for poetry, adventure and leadership has earned him a place in the hearts of many around the world. However, behind the public persona lies a man seeking companionship and partnership in life. It was in the vibrant city of Dubai that Sheikh Hamdan's path intertwined with that of Sheikh Sheikha bin Said bin Thani Al Maktoum. Born into the prestigious Al Maktoum family, Sheikha Sheikha possessed grace, intelligence, and a quiet strength that complemented Sheikh Hamdan's dynamic personality. Their union, celebrated in a solemn religious ceremony in Dubai, marked a significant milestone in Sheikh Hamdan's life. Surrounded by family and friends, the couple exchanged vows, pledging to support and cherish each other through life's journey. As their love story unfolded, Sheikh Hamdan and Sheikha Sheikha embarked on a new chapter of their lives. Parenthood. Blessed with the joy of children, their family grew in both size and love. Their firstborns, twins Rashid bin Hamdan al Maktoum and Sheikha bin Hamdan al Maktoum, brought laughter and warmth into their home. With each coup and giggle, Sheikh Hamdan and Sheikha Sheikha's bond deepened, strengthened by the shared joy of raising their children. The arrival of their third child, Mohammed bin Hamdan al Maktoum, further enriched their lives, filling their days with endless possibilities and dreams for the future. Together, they embraced the responsibilities of parenthood with grace and dedication, instilling in their children the values of compassion, integrity, and humility. In the tapestry of the Al Maktoum family, Sheikha Sheikha bin Said bin Thani Al Maktoum's lineage holds a rich history and heritage. As the daughter of Sheikh Said bin Thani Al Maktoum, her roots run deep within the royal lineage of Dubai. Her mother, Sheikha Sheikha bin Said bin Maktoum Al Maktoum, was the daughter of Emir Said II of Dubai, forging familial connections that spanned generations. Through her maternal lineage, Sheikha Sheikha found herself not only a wife to Sheikh Hamdan, but also a first cousin, and through her father a second cousin, creating a tapestry of familial ties that bind them closer together. While the world may glimpse into the lives of Sheikh Hamdan and Sheikha Sheikha, through occasional glimpses and snapshots, their relationship remains a deeply personal matter, deserving of respect and sensitivity. Amidst the glare of the spotlight, they navigate the delicate balance between their public duties and private moments, carving out spaces of intimacy and reflection amidst the grandeur of royal life. Their love story serves as a reminder that behind the titles and ceremonies, they are two individuals bound by love and commitment. As they look towards the future, Sheikh Hamdan and Sheikha Sheikha envision a legacy built not on wealth or power, but on the foundation of love, family and service to their people. Together, they aspire to lead with compassion and humility, embodying the values that have defined the Al Maktoum dynasty for generations. Their journey, marked by love, loyalty and devotion, continues to inspire generations both within and beyond the borders of Dubai. As they walk hand in hand, they do so with the knowledge that their union is not just a marriage of two individuals, but a celebration of the enduring spirit of love and unity that transcends boundaries and cultures. In the bustling metropolis of Dubai, amidst the towering skyscrapers and bustling streets, a love story unfolds, one of royalty and romance, duty and devotion. Sheikh Hamdan bin Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum and Sheikha Sheikha bin Said bin Thani. Al Maktoum's union is not just a marriage of two individuals, but a testament to the enduring power of love to conquer all, as they journey through life together, may their love continue to inspire and uplift those around them, lighting the way for a brighter, more compassionate future for all. Today we are pleased to share with you some fascinating and unique updates regarding Sheikh Hamdan and his family. 
Make sure that you click the bell sign and the subscribe button if you haven't done so already. This will ensure that you are always up to speed with the most recent news. So let's get started with the story, as it is occurring. Fazer extended an invitation to Hadia Zen to travel to Dubai and spend some quality time with her twins, who are currently staying there. Nevertheless, Sheikh Athani, who is Sheikh Hamdan's first wife, had the opportunity to learn about the recently acquired mansion. However, she is not aware of the reason for its purchase. However, in order to ensure the safety of Hadia and her twin children, Sheikh Hamdan purchased an additional luxurious mansion for them. The arrival of Hadia Zen in Dubai took place on December 4th that year. After that, Sheikh Hamdan took her to the newly purchased mansion after picking her up from the airport. After that, she came to the realization that the mansion that Sheikh Hamdan had mentioned earlier was not the case. Next, Hadia inquired about that matter with Sheikh Hamdan. After that, Sheikh Hamdan divulged the complete account of the events. He explained how Sheikh Athani learned about the first estate that he purchased, as well as how Sheikh Athani went to visit that mansion. The entire situation was clear to Hadia. She appears to have a lot of compassion. On the other hand, Sheikh Hamdan was overwhelmed with happiness with Hadia's ideas. Immediately following that, Sheikh Hamdan went to his own palace and selected his twins from within the palace. With the intention of preventing Sheikh Athani, Sheikh Hamdan's first wife, from becoming suspicious, he dropped them off to Hadia's mansion and then returned them to his palace. Despite this, Thani did not inquire about the twins, despite the fact that they frequently visit Zabil Palace. Having said that, Hadia and her twins are now living together in the newly purchased mansion, although they are not residing in the first mansion, but rather in the second mansion. Given that Sheikh Thani has previously been to the house, Sheikh Hamdan has come up with the idea of presenting Sheikh Thani with the first ever purchased mansion as a present for the new year. On the other hand, she is unaware of the fact that Hadia is currently residing in Dubai with her children. The information shown below is the most recent report regarding Sheikh Hamdan and his family. Prince Faza is a man of many talents, but despite his mysterious secrets of being a crucial member of Dubai's royal family, here are some facts that you may have not heard about him. Starting off with his poetic talent, Sheikh Hamdan is a renowned poet, known by his pen name Faza, which means the one who helps in Arabic. His poetry, often written in the traditional Nabati style, reflects themes of love, chivalry, and patriotism. This artistic pursuit reveals a more creative and introspective side to his character. Character, distinct from his public persona as a political figure, adventure sports enthusiast. Beyond his known interests in equestrian sports and falconry, Sheikh Hamdan is an avid adventure sports enthusiast. He actively participates in skydiving, diving and other extreme sports. His Instagram account often features photos and videos of his adventures, showcasing his love for adrenaline pumping activities. Animal lover and conservation advocate, Sheikh Hamdan is a passionate animal lover, particularly fond of horses and camels. His his commitment extends beyond personal interest, as he is actively involved in animal conservation efforts, particularly for endangered species. He champions various wildlife protection initiatives, reflecting his dedication to environmental and conservation issues. Photography Aficionado, he is also an accomplished photographer, capturing moments from his travels, adventures and daily life. His photography often focuses on the natural beauty of landscapes and the candid moments of people, offering a glimpse into his perspective and appreciation for the world around him. Commitment to fitness and health. Sheikh Hamdan places a strong emphasis on fitness and health. He is often seen participating in marathons, cycling events, and fitness challenges. His involvement in these activities not only reflects his personal dedication to staying fit, but also serves as an inspiration for the youth in the UAE to adopt healthy lifestyles. Technological innovation supporter. Apart from his official role in promoting Dubai as a tech hub, he personally shows keen interest in technology technological advancements. He is known to support various tech startups and innovation projects, aligning his personal interests with his vision for Dubai's future. Even though Sheikh Hamdan I well respected in the Dubai community, here are some controversies he faces as the face of Dubai. Challenges Sheikh Hamdan bin Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum, as a prominent figure in Dubai's royal family and its government, has faced several challenges reflective of the broader dynamics of the region and his significant responsibilities. Economic diversification. 
a major challenge Sheikh Hamdan has confronted is the diversification of Dubai's economy. Given the fluctuating nature of oil prices, there's been a need to transition the economy towards sectors like tourism, aviation, real estate, and finance. As the Crown Prince, he has played a pivotal role in driving these changes, balancing traditional economic practices with modern demands and global economic trends, technological advancement, and innovation. Another significant challenge has been positioning Dubai as a hub for technological innovation and smart city development. This involves integrating advanced technologies across various sectors, which requires not only substantial investment, but also foresight and strategic planning. Sheikh Hamdan has been instrumental in promoting and overseeing these technological advancements, ensuring Dubai remains at the forefront of the digital revolution. Youth empowerment and employment. Addressing the issue of youth empowerment and employment in the region has been another focus area. With a significant proportion of the population being under 30, creating opportunities and harnessing the potential of the youth is vital. Sheikh Hamdan's initiatives in education, entrepreneurship, and innovation are aimed at providing young people with the skills and opportunities needed to succeed in a rapidly changing world. Controversies. While Sheikh Hamdan is widely respected like any public figure, he has not been completely immune to controversies, although these have been relatively minor and often based on broader political or economic issues rather than personal actions. Economic challenges. Dubai's rapid economic growth has occasionally been met with challenges such as the 2009 debt crisis. While not a direct controversy for Sheikh Hamdan personally, as a key figure in the government, he has been involved in navigating these complex economic situations, striving to to maintain stability and growth. International relations. The United Arab Emirates, of which Dubai is a part, occasionally faces scrutiny regarding its foreign policy and regional relations. Sheikh Hamdan, as part of the ruling family, is sometimes indirectly associated with these broader diplomatic and geopolitical issues. Media representation. Another area of mild controversy has involved the representation of Dubai and its leadership in international media. There have been instances where the portrayal of Dubai Dubai's policies and practices has sparked debate. Although Sheikh Hamdan himself typically maintains a positive public image focused on development and innovation, Faza's personal life, while largely private, offers glimpses into the character and preferences of Dubai's crown prince. These details provide a richer understanding of his personality and lifestyle. Family ties. Sheikh Hamdan is known for his strong family connections, particularly his close relationship with his father, Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum, the ruler of Dubai. He often expresses profound respect and admiration for his father, highlighting the importance of family values in his life. Additionally, his interactions with his siblings and other family members are marked by warmth and camaraderie, indicating a tight-knit family unit. Marriage. In 2019, Sheikh Hamdan married Sheikha Sheikha bint Saeed bin Thani Al Maktoum. The marriage, which was a significant event in Dubai, underscored his commitment to tradition and family. The union also reflects the cultural and social customs of the UAE, wherein family and matrimonial alliances hold significant importance. Cultural advocate, he is deeply rooted in Emirati culture and traditions. Despite his exposure to global cultures and modernity, Sheikh Hamdan often demonstrates a strong connection to his Emirati heritage, whether through his attire, participation in traditional events, or his promotion of local customs and language. Lifestyle. While he leads a luxurious lifestyle befitting his royal status, Sheikh Hamdan is also known for his down-to-earth demeanor. He often engages with people from different walks of life, reflecting a personable and approachable in nature. This aspect of his personality is especially evident in his public appearances and social media interactions. Philanthropic involvement beyond his official duties, he is deeply involved in humanitarian causes. He supports various charitable initiatives both within the UAE and internationally, focusing on areas such as education, health, and poverty alleviation. His philanthropic work demonstrates a commitment to using his position and resources for the greater good. Interests in arts and culture. Apart from his love for sports and adventure, Sheikh Hamdan has shown a keen interest in arts and culture. He is often seen attending cultural events and supporting the arts, emphasizing 
his appreciation for the diverse expressions of creativity. Sheikh Hamdan, also known as Faza, is the crown prince of Dubai. He's not just a leader, he's also famous for many other things. Faza loves writing poetry, and people really like his poems. He writes about love, his country, and important issues in society. He's also really into sports and adventure. Faza loves horse riding, skydiving, and other exciting sports. This shows he's brave and likes to have fun. He uses these sports to help make Dubai known as a great place for tourism and adventure. Faza also does a lot of charity work. He helps with education, health, and taking care of the environment. This shows he cares about making life better for people in the UAE. He's also pretty active on social media, like Instagram, where lots of people follow him. He shares pictures and stories about his work and his adventures. This makes him seem friendly and easy to relate to, even though he's royalty. Even with all this going on, Faza always acts respectfully and keeps up the traditions of his culture. He's good at handling many different roles, as a leader, a sportsman, a poet, and someone who helps others. This mix of roles shows the energy and forward thinking of Dubai leaders. Being famous like Sheikh Hamdan is can be tough sometimes, especially when it comes to privacy. Since he's the crown prince of Dubai, he gets a lot of attention. This means doing normal things like eating out or shopping can be hard because people always recognize him. He can't just go out and relax without drawing a crowd or the media noticing him. This attention doesn't just affect him. His family and friends also get noticed more because they're close to someone so famous they have to be really careful about what they do, which can change the way they act around each other. Also, the media is always talking about him. This is good for letting people know what he's doing, but sometimes they get things wrong. Rumors and false information can spread, which can be upsetting for him and his loved ones. In today's world, with social media, this problem is even bigger. Social media is great for talking directly to people, but it can also lead to more rumors and less privacy. Sheikh Hamdan has to be careful about how he uses these platforms. He tries to share with the public, but also keep his private life safe. Privacy is really important for someone like Sheikh Hamdan, who is always in the spotlight. Here's why it's so important for him, making decisions. When he's away from everyone's eyes, Sheikh Hamdan can think more clearly. He can make better decisions without worrying about what everyone else will think, relaxing. Just like anyone else, he needs a break from being famous. Having private time helps him rest and feel better so he can do his job as a leader with more energy and focus. Real friendships. It's hard for famous people to know if others like them for who they are or just because they are famous. When he's in private, Sheikh Hamdan can be sure that his friendships and family relationships are real and not just because of his title. Staying safe. Being a well-known person can sometimes be risky. Keeping his personal life private helps keep him and his family safe. Cultural respect. In Sheikh Hamdan's culture, privacy is very important. Respecting his need for privacy is a way of showing respect for his culture. It's about honoring personal space and dignity. When it comes to famous people like Sheikh Hamdan, both the news and the public have a big role to play in respecting their privacy. The news reporters should be careful about what they share. They need to think about whether something is really important for people to know or if it's just being nosy. People who like Sheikh Hamdan should also remember that it's okay to be a fan, but they shouldn't try to know everything about his private life. He's famous, but he also deserves to have his own space just like everyone else. Social media makes things a bit trickier. Even though Sheikh Hamdan might post on Instagram or Twitter, this doesn't mean people should forget about his privacy. Comments and messages should be nice and shouldn't poke into his personal life. What the public chooses to read and talk about also matters a lot. If people show they prefer news that respects privacy, then the news will start to follow this too. This way, everyone can enjoy learning about Sheikh Hamdan's work and life with Without making him uncomfortable. Sheikh Hamdan's role as the Crown Prince of Dubai places him in a unique position where his actions and decisions have far-reaching implications. His dedication to his official responsibilities, his passion for sports and culture, and his commitment to philanthropy are all facets of his public persona that are greatly admired. However, it's important to recognize that behind this public figure is an individual who values his personal space and privacy.